Qué fuerte. Es. No. Eh, ¿Me escuchan ahora? Sí. Yes. ¿Me escuchan? Contésteme, sí. por favor. Sí. 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 Que me estaba pidiendo grabar en la nube. Ah, vale. Ahora, ¿alguno de ustedes puede hablar para ver si les escucho? Hola, hola, hola. 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 Ay, qué divertido, no les escucho. No. Y que cuando vea esta grabación... Sí, pero no sé cuál es el problema de Zoom. Porque no me está grabando, me dice acá, pero yo no escucho el sonido. Y ustedes escuchan cuando sí, sí, escucharon todo, cuando Zoom dijo recording. Todo, sí, yes. todo, sí, escucharon. Todo, Muy bien. Sí, sí. No sé cuál será el problema con Zoom. Las actualizaciones. Cuando inició la grabación nuevamente, sí escucharon. Sí. Hola. Sí, 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 sí. sí escucharon. Sí. Okay, el recording, sí. Como diría Cristina, bye bye. Ah, pero Carlos, sí, sí, sí. ahora sí, este, necesito hola. que hablen uno de ustedes. Hola, hola, hola. Hola, hola, hola. Hola, hola, hola. hola, 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 hola. No sé ¿Qué estará sucediendo? Como los teletubbies. Entonces no es problema mi audífono, sino que creo que es problema de Zoom. Porque acá me aparece todo bien. Vacation, vacation. Sí, es que yo creo que la computadora ya necesita. Ya necesita que se moje la computadora. ¿En quién puso estamos hablando? Yo. ¿Y por qué grita? Bien, ¿no me escuchan? Sí me escuchan ustedes, pero yo no los escucho a ustedes. Vámonos. Ok, bien, entonces vamos a trabajar. Así es, así es. Sorda, okay, right? class. Here we go. Uh, did you finish the practice that I assigned to you? No, yes no or no? no you didn't. Okay, great, excellent. Now let's continue because we need to uh, an antecedent for the uh, second part of the class. Because how to use be going to? Look at the word symbols and complete the sentences below. Affirmative sentences and yes no questions. In affirmative sentences, we say I'm going to arrive until Monday. Mrs. Puentes is going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. The negative sentences, Mrs. Puentes is not going to fly to Cuba on the 14th. Mr. Gomez is not going to arrive on Thursday and the base form to describe. A schedule activities and activities that will definitely happen in the future for negative sentences you have to insert not before going to. Let's analyze the sentences. <clears throat> I'm going to I'm going to stay until Monday. Miss Fuentes is going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. But in the negative sentences we have, Miss Fuentes is not going to fly to Cuba on the 14th. Mr. Gomez is not going to arrive on that between is and going to. And here we have the rule. Use be going to plus the verb plus the base form to describe, okay? To describe a schedule activities and activities that will definitely happen in the future. For negative sentences insert, but in the other part of the box, we have yes, no questions. What happens here? Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? Information questions. How long are you going to stay When are you going to arrive? A schedule activities. You begin with the verb be plus the subject plus going to plus the verb. For information questions, just place the WH word phrase at the beginning of the question and continue like you would do for a yes no question. A, when are you going to arrive? How long is the WH question phrase? And when is the WH question word? And look at this, are you going to stay? Are you going to arrive? We write R and R because the subject is now class, it is the time for you to work. Order the words to create sentences and questions about schedule activities, about activities that have been programmed or activities that um, have been uh, set in your agenda. The example going to when arrive R. When are you going to arrive to Dallas? Yes. When are you going to arrive to Dallas? Now go over number two, three, four, five, and six, please. Okay. Yes, teacher. Let's do it individually, please. Let's unscramble those sentences. Please, when you finish, you let me know, okay? When you finish on a scrambling, 
these uh, words to create the sentences, please let me know. Finish, Miguel. Wow. Te voy a decir que sí, como no me escucha. <laughs> no, teacher, todavía no. One moment. A reservation. Ay, uh. Alguien ya terminó que le diga a la teacher. I'm going to make. Let's see if I have all the people here. Yes, I have a uh, great. I wonder. Carlos, why are you sharing the, the answer? Sorry, teacher, sorry, sorry. Not sorry. yet. Let the others work, okay? I know that you are very enthusiastically working, but uh, okay. okay hold it, hold it, please. Okay, great. Some of you are telling me that uh, you finished. Okay, who else finished? Wilbur is done, and Carlos, I think that you finished too, right? And maybe Hazel. Did you finish, Not Hazel? Yet, sure. Not yet. No, yes. Okay, let's wait a couple of minutes while the others finish. Okay, take your time. Remember to go over the structure. Yes, check out the information in the grammar box over here so you make sure that your sentences are correct over here. For affirmative, just no questions, information questions and negative sentences. Mm -hmm. Yes. 
yes, yes, yes. Yes. Okay, here we go. Uh, Wilbur says that okay, the new message, Miguel also finished. Okay, great. Here we go. Let's try to analyze sentence by sentence. Okay, Rafa is also done. Hate self finish, great. So let's analyze sentence by sentence in order to standardize our answers, okay? In number two, the given words are are a reservation, the, you, going to, for, conference room, make. No, in, in a question mark, yeah. And then we don't see any WH question word, so we say it is a simple sentence. And here we go, okay? Let's get started then. Our reservation day, you, going for, conference room, make. But in the first one, we don't see any any question mark and it is a question. So are a reservation day you going to for the conference room? Probably is it a question or a simple sentence? What do you think class? Tell me via chat because I am deaf right now. Okay, is it a question or a simple sentence? What do you think? Okay, thank you for your messages. A question, yes. Okay, so we need to make it up and look for the best alternative of the WH question word. Then we say, probably when, yes, because it is about a time. When are you going to, when are you going to make a reservation? Is that okay? When are you going to make a reservation? Or are you going to make a reservation for the conference room? Okay, let's see the possibilities. When are you going to make um, when are you going to make a reservation for the conference room? Is that okay? Yes, okay. When are you going to make a reservation for the conference room? Question mark. Is that okay? Do you agree, partially agree, or disagree? Agree, partially agree, or disagree? Partially agree. Okay, uh, Isabel, write yours. <laughs> okay, some people are saying here that they agree. Excellent, very well. But um, Isabel, would you mind sharing your screen? Okay, some of the people are saying that they agree. Isabel, uh, share your, your sentence to the class. Share your screen. Uh, the microphone, Isabel. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay, share your sentence. Igual Hazel says that no she le agrees, le and le Carlos le says le that he agrees, no me but me Isabel me is partially in agreement. No, la hice como pregunta. Yo la hice más como una. Afirmación. Isabel, can you share? Sí, yo la hice como una afirmación. Está mal. Compañeros, ustedes que saben más que yo, porque no le puedo tomar tiempo por la pantalla en mi ladito este para mandarse. Yo le voy a corregir. Ya. <laughs> Pero ella decía que teníamos que seguir la... Uh, I continue with the problem that I cannot listen to you. So I would appreciate if you share your screen or if you please uh, write in the chat. No puede compartir pantalla, Isabel. No puedo. You cannot share the screen. Why not? Hazel, would you try if you will share the screen? Okay, Carlos, share your screen. Okay. I need to know. I need to know if you are able Parte to share la screen. Ah, Okay, so only the problem is only with the sound. Okay, but your sentences, Carlos. Ya le leímos toda la pantalla. <laughs> Carlos, your sentences. Hola, hola. Share with us your no sentences, le va a escuchar, Carlos. Solamente compártale la respuesta. Ahí está. La, la, no, 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 ah, no, 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 no. Tu escritorio está juntando. Your sentences, Carlos. Ah, perdón, perdón. Ya le leímos todo. Lo ah, vimos ah, el sorry, computer. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> the top of your computer. Ahora. Okay, here. Let's see. When are you going to make 
it is a reservation, not a reservation, because in the expression you have a reservation. When are you going to make a reservation for the conference room? A conference for maybe for the conference room, yeah? No, Carlos. Make a, when are you going to make, to make a, a reservation? A, a, this make, letter A, listen to me, Carlos. When are you going to make a, a reservation? A reservation, Carlos. A, a reservation. <laughs> Yeah, ya tiene esa palabra. Ya no For the tiene. conference room, that's okay. Now, let's see number three. I'm going to request a wake-up a wake up call. I'm going to request a wake-up call. A wake-up call for 5 a.m. That's okay. Going to. Tomorrow, check out is Miss Turcios. Miss Turcios is going to check out tomorrow. The full stop. The full stop. El punto final, the full stop. Okay. And what about number five and six? We have in number five, on conference going to, a man and a steam is at the end of the October 10th. Okay, so what if we say, man and a steam is going to attend the conference on October 10th, the full stop, and at the beginning, capital letter, because all the sentences begin with capital letter. Man and his team is going to attend the conference on October 10th. Very well. And uh, non-smoking room. Miss Diaz, a meal is going to. Uh, is going to. Excellent. A non-smoking room. Very well. Miss Diaz is going to need a non-smoking room. Excellent. Very well. Now, do you agree? Partially La, agree. Donde queda agree, en class. agree. Excellent. Carlos says agree 100%. Agree. Yeah. Disagree. I know. Partial, have to be uh, okay. non agree. agree. Partially agree or disagree. We, we agree. agree. Yes, he's going to need. Very good. Oh, now no, that we have standardized the answers. No, ahí le falta una. Le falta we are la... going to go over exercise number ah, six. Sí, sí, what are we going hola, hola. to do? Ya, yes, yes. Ya se pasa la otra unidad. Number six. Yes, <laughs> ya se pasa la otra okay, unidad. Okay, I'm going to hold it. No nos escucha. <laughs> Carlos, leave it like that for a while, okay? Yes. Déjelo ahí hola. un momentito, Carlos. Hola. Okay, so okay. they double check. <laughs> Sabe que saquen a Carlos, por favor. <laughs> okay, finished. Yes. yes. Shall we go over the next activity? Finish. Yes. La pagaste. Okay. okay. Leti. Hello, Leti. Everything wow. is recorded. Todo está Hola. grabando la grabación. Bye. Hoy se ya nos escucha, teacher. Teacher. Okay, shall we? Solo Leti. Yes. <laughs> okay, okay, Carlos. Thank you. Thank you so much for sharing. Okay. And now, class, you continue with the next activity. I need you to use your imagination because in exercise six, think of two business events that you are going to attend. Assign dates for each. Practice making a hotel reservation for those dates. In other words, okay, think of two business events that you are going to attend and assign dates for each. Practice asking and making a hotel reservation for those dates. In other words, what is a conversation similar to this one, okay? Van a crear una conversación similar, parecida a esta, cambiando las fechas de llegada y la fecha de salida, ¿sí? Y luego, luego la practican y la presentan, okay. pero tienen que escribirla. You have to write it because it is required for you to practice writing the structures, okay? okay. Did you get it? Yes. Yes, sí, comprendimos yes, la actividad. Sí, teacher. Ok. Now I'm going to transfer you to the breakout rooms right now. Ok. So here we go. Okay. And let's see. Ok, I'm going to send you to your... Ah, uh, but before you go to the breakout rooms, I'm going to take the attendance. And you just like this, you say it because in the, in the recording it's going to appear. Ok. Maybe I don't listen, but in the recording it is going to appear. Andrea Lisbeth. Where are you, Andrea? Yeah, no, okay. Now let's continue with Carlos. Dedito arriba. Carlos is here. You have to say 
here I am, here I am. or here I presente am. or present, present, okay? Because uh, in the recording, it is going okay. to appear your voice. Elizabeth Johanna, Elizabeth Johanna, Evelyn, your microphone, Evelyn. Present. Excellent. And even so, listen, even though I don't listen, but your microphone appears active, okay? In the recording, Floor. Floor. Present. Thank you, Miss Flor. Freddy Celiseo. Okay, Freddy, thank you via chat. Hazel. Here. Always here. Very active, Miss Hazel. Always. Julio Cesar. Yes, okay, great. Excellent. Catherine, is Catherine yes. here? Yes, she's here. Maria Isabel. Isabel. Present. Present. Oh, yes, here she is. <laughs> Letty. Present. Always here. Okay, great. <laughs> Marvin, Marvin, are you here? Ah, Julio Cesar is here, okay. Uh, Matthew, Mateo. Present. Okay, Mateo, thank you. Miguel Angel. Present, teacher. Always here, very close to the, to the clouds in heaven. Natalia is absent. Rafael, here. here. Thank you, Rafa. Rudy, where are you, Rudy? Rudy is a listener today. Virginia. Present. Thank you, Virginia, here. Is absent Miss Wendy and Wilbur. Present yes, teacher. Wilbur is here. Okay, so right now, class, I'm going to transfer you to the breakout rooms and create the conversation, okay? But you need to type it because that is the requirement in the, in the manual because they need you to practice the structures. Here we go. Let's see. Okay, go to your groups, but I have Marvin, Romeo, and Rafael. You lost the connectivity. You had problems with the app or with your internet, so I'm going to assign you to another group, okay? And here we go. Okay, Rafael. Go to group number three. Miguel, go to group number two. And Marvin. Go to group mm, number one, okay? Go to your groups, people. Join your groups, please. I need you to go to your groups. Join your groups, Flor, Marvin, and Rudy. Go to your groups, please. Join your groups. Flora and Marvin, join your groups. Entonces sería hello. Thank you for calling Sheraton Presidente Hotel. This is Isabel o Joana, el nombre que vaya, quien vaya a decirlo, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Teacher no escucha. No, no, no escucha. <laughs> This is Isabel. How can I help you? Sheraton. Ajá, bueno. Here I am. Ahorita la estoy editando. ¿Me escuchan? Yes. ¿Me oyen? <laughs> sí, me oye. Pero yes. yo no los oigo. <laughs> okay, continue, please. Okay. Hello, I need to make a reservation. Um, ahorita ya estoy editándole los nombres. Ya, Julio ya lo terminó. Y nosotros el, ahí medio comenzando. Viene con todo, Julio. Y que no la, no, es que solamente la copian. Pero usted. Pues sí, copianla y, y nada más le van a, a cambiar el nombre. Le van a poner Jen, Jen le van a poner el suyo. Yeah, sure. okay. ¿Quién lo va a poner, por ejemplo, conmigo? Yo que no les puedo compartir la pantalla. Me siento autóctona. Espérame, momento. ahorita lo voy a editar. Yo. Y ya lo he hecho antes. Pero me siento autóctona. Of course. I ¿Quién, am... María? El Hotel El Real Intercontinental. Oh. Ajá. Y ahí pegan. Y ahí este, pueden pegar la, la conversación, ¿verdad? Ya. Yeah. 
Okay. And in this case, I think that we I we change to change the name of the hotel because we are going to look for another hotel. Mm -hmm. It can be the President Hotel, the Plaza Hotel. Use your imagination, okay? Yeah. If you have the chance, okay, and it is paid by your company. But you don't have to pay because it is a hotel street, okay? Paris Hilton Hotel. <laughs> no, me escucha, no. Teacher. no, quizás no. Hello, pero ahí vaya, eh, por ejemplo, estamos activos, ¿cuántos aquí? Porque era el papá del regañado. Pero le digo, mira, le digo, si lo único que creo que te va a interrumpir, le digo, de tu cama a tu máquina, puede ser o el perro, el gato, el papá. Remember, class, I didn't use uh, the name of the hotel. Okay? You replace the Star Hotel by another name. Okay. Use your imagination. Remember that you are not going to pay okay. anything. Okay? Mm -hmm. Your company is going to afford those yes. expenses. Okay. Su compañía es la que va a pasar, pagar esos gastos. <risa> so, just a nice hotel. Okay. A five stars hotel. Yeah. Sí. sí. Entonces, horrible, horrible, la verdad, súper sí. horrible. Y, bueno, al final, el Hola. apellido pues, sería eh, Evelyn Molina porque se ve como muy, muy, muy informal. Él solo es Anne Evelyn. ¿Cómo, ¿Cómo dijiste? Sería Anne Evelyn Molina. Anne Evelyn Molina en my, in my friends is Javier Gómez. Uh. I'm Evelyn Molina. Ajá, uh -huh. um, Evelyn Molina and my friend is Javier Gómez. Ajá, uh -huh. ok. And... Thank you, yeah, Miguel, thank you. Thank uh -huh. you, Mr. Mr. Mol uh, Miss, Mrs. Molina. Miss Molina. Miss Molina, Molina exacto, Miss, Miss Molina. Miss Molina. Molina. When are Where you... are you going to arrive? Entonces aquí podemos hacer que Miss Molina le pase la llamada a Miss Ajá. Gómez, por ejemplo, sí. ¿te parece? Para que él dé la información que está pidiendo, Ajá, Miguel, correcto. digo yo. Pero, ¿Cómo sería ahí para decirle, eh, el... le pasaré a, le, eh, Juan Omen, le paso, le paso a, mi, a mi amigo para que le dé esa información de forgive the information? Ah, sería, le comunicaré, ah, sería, para... le comunicaré a my friends. A mi amigo, para a mi amigo, para que le brinde la información. I told, sería, I told my friends to give him the information. Se lo voy a pasar aquí por chat. I tell, he, I'll tell my friend to give you I that told, information. Porque le pasaré como en pasado. Eh. Le comunicaré a mi amigo para que le brinde esa información. Yes. Eh, quiero ver cómo, cómo te parece. Ah. Ahora les aparece el, el chat. Ahí se lo mandé. El el yes. chol es pasado. Sí, pero es que como dice, le pasaré. Dice, no, le comunique. Ah, perdón, le comuniqué, le puse. No sé por qué le puse, le comuniqué. Mm -hmm. Le comunicaré, Ahí le comunicaré. Um, yes, I will tell my friends. Eh, yes, ahí es, tell. En ah. esa parte es la de, ah, después de que tú preguntas, eh, contesta a Evelyn. ¿no? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ok. Y luego, Ajá, eh, entonces, ahí es correcto. Ahí vamos a agregar esa parte. Entonces ah, yo le contesto perf, eh, perfect o no problem. ¿Ese? No problem. Ah, correcto, para alargarlo. Uh -huh. I will tell my friend. Nos va siguiendo, Evelyn. Sí, sí. Y le dice que terminaría María, ¿verdad? Hola. ¿Terminaríamos con, 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 con María o haríamos con No, yo le diría al final. Ok. ¿Qué me diría al final? A president suite, okay. I'm going to get the double room. Uh, presidential suite. That's good, suite. the presidential suite. Suite. The presidential yeah. suite. The presidential room, not single or double, no. The best. Uh -huh. A presidential suite. suite or the double room. <laughs> okay, that's okay. You want to request transportation from the airport to our hotel? Remember that question is, are you going to use the, or are you going to need the shuttle, the shuttle so, service? Sure. It is the transportation the transportation service from the airport to the hotel. That is shuttle, what you, what you were practicing yesterday, mm -hmm. do you remember? ¿Se recuerdan ayer que estábamos usando la frase shuttle? Ah, Isabel, you were not in class. That is why, yeah? So, the traditional one, you want, do you want here? Do you want to? Not you want, do you want to? Make the correction here. Do, do you, you want to request request the trans do, you. do you want? Okay. Do you, do you want to request transfer? You is with a small, small letter. letter. And I'm um, sorry, do is with big letter and you la y small letter. La tiene. You do con you. letra minúscula. Exacto. Exactamente. You. Okay. Do you want to do request, you want to request transportation, transportation from the airport to our hotel? Sure. 
En julio, su. Sure. <risa> sure. <risa> es, ¿Estaría bien esa respuesta o tiene que ser más larga? Uh, yo creo que... La respuesta que tiene la señora. Eh, ¿Cómo le podría poner usted? Me parece bien. Eh, yo yo lo, que, lo que le respondería es, eh, sería... Do you want request for the eh, Sure, please. Sí me gustaría. Yo en esa clase sí no estuve ayer, Julio. Pero déjenme ver el manual. Solo tengo que ver. Mire, y la, 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 la cuestión es que ella dijo presidencial suite o es presidencial room. Eso le voy a cambiar. No, pero le pregunto. Yo para mí, para mí, que está bien, pero como... Sure. Póngale la hora. Sure. Okay, eh, okay, sería a las... Hello, I need to make a Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I'm Julio Celaya. Thank you, Mr. Celaya. When are you going to arrive? I'm going to arrive on Monday the 12th. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Celaya? I'm going to stay until Monday. Are you going to make the reservation for a single? Or do you want to request transportation from the airport to our hotel? Sure. Okay. Uh, That's sí. good. Very well. Congratulations. Es que aquí, aquí, Now aquí, practice. Esta parte no la vio, por eso es que And I think usted. that Flor no. is back. Maybe she would like to practice with you. Okay. Flor ya, ya se reincorporó porque estaba teniendo problemas con okay. Zoom. Entonces, eh, tal vez puede practicar okay. con usted. Okay, sure. okay. Great. I'm going to monitor another group, okay? See you. Okay, let me see. Hello. Thank you for calling the Paris Hilton Hotel. This is Virginia. How can I help you? Hello, I need to make the reservation. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course, I'm Carlos Sarsin. Thank you, Mr. Suarez. Arrive on Friday, 16th March. How long are you going to stay with us, Mr. Sarseño? I'm going to stay until Monday, and I think, uh, March. Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? A double room, please. How, mm, how many more people come with you? One, no. One more person. One more person. One oh, more person. Al revés. Make the correction. One more person. And here, how begins with capital letter? Remember, all the sentences begin with capital letter. Recuerden, todas las letras comienzan con mayúscula. Ok, teacher. Eh, siempre no se escucha. Todavía no, ¿verdad? No. No, ok. Um. Ok, continue Bye. writing the closing. Bien, yeah, más. Vaya. Ok. Um. Estábamos ahí una persona más. Ella pediría el nombre. What you, what you like? Vivienda El Salvador, que es tarjetas y cobros. Y está Bacred. Almost también. finished. Tenemos... Or not yet. Yes, we finished. We finished. Ready. Okay. Uh, there are some other groups that are still working in the construction of the conversation. So maybe in one minute okay. we're going okay. to return. Okay. Thank you and congrats for your responsibility, not only in the breakout rooms, not only in the class, because also okay, in the plan before you. Okay, excellent. Thank you. My excellent students. Yeah. <laughs> thank you. Okay, thank you. See you later. Okay. I'm going to monitor okay. the other teams. Okay. okay. Evelyn Molina and my friend. Uh, did you finish? No, yes. Uh, hello. Thank you for calling the Heaven Hotel. Heaven is the name of the hotel with capital H, okay. letra mayúscula. Heaven Hotel. This is Miguel. How can I help you? Evelyn. Evelyn is a proper name, right? Es nombre propio, Evelyn, ¿verdad? Entonces va con mayúscula. Uh, hello, I would like to make a reservation for two people. Sure. May I have your, no, your names. Eliminate the R on yours. May I have your names? Your names. Esa, esa, ese elimine. La I se la está marcando la computadora. Okay, your names, please. Of course. I'm uh, Evelyn Molina. Capital letter <laughs> Evelyn and Molina. Los nombres sí. y apellidos con mayúscula. Evelyn Molina, Molina, capital M. El apellido Molina va con mayúscula. And my friend, and my friend is Javier. Ok, and my friend, aquí tiene una S extra, friends. Because you're referring, ok, my friend is Javier Gómez. Thank you, Miss Molina. When are you going to arrive? I will tell my friend to give him the information. Miguel, no problem. No problem, no, no problem. <laughs> Uh, yes, <laughs> we are going to arrive on April the 5th. April with capital letter, okay? April with capital letter. 
April, capital letter. Miguel, how long, capital letter, uh, how long? How long are you going to stay with us? Mr. Gomez, have your answers. We are going to stay until Sunday. Sunday with capital letter. Los días de la semana en inglés van con mayúscula. And we, el inicio de la oración va con mayúscula. We are going to stay until. Miguel with capital letter. Are you going to make a reservation for a single or a double room? A double room, please. Perfect. Thank you. Uh, thank you. You are missing at an N. And thank you for calling us. Perfect with capital letter. Perfect with capital letter and thank you. Okay, perfect. Capital letter. Okay, that's it. Very well. Ah, you say. Mm -hmm. Okay. Everything is reported. <laughs> okay, let's get back to the um to the main session room. Okay, si no escucha, teacher. Ah, but in perfect. Thank you for calling us. The full stop. At the end. No. Punto final. Le hace falta. Don't forget the punctuation acá and calling us. Okay, great. Now let's return to the no, main session no room. Todavía. Save the information. Guarde la información. No, no. If it's okay. possible, take a screenshot, okay? Okay. See you in the main session room. Que volvamos dice al main room. Okay, let's wait for the others. You did a big effort class. Congratulations. And you know that it is different when you only complete, when you take a screenshot and you only complete. But the good practice is when you type because you use the real structures and you use your um, your skills. And that is the way that we improve. Es la forma en la que mejoramos. Okay, let's wait for the others to come back. Listen, I think that this is a problem with the platform because if it was my problem, you wouldn't listen to me. Okay, here, here we are. Let's wait for the other partners. Mm -hmm. Okay. Class, listen, I was monitoring your, your conversations and there are only a few points that I need to remark. Remember, when writing, when typing, the names of the months, the names of the days begin in English with capital letter. Los nombres de los meses del año, de los días de la semana, en inglés los escribimos con mayúscula, ¿ok? The names of the places, capital letter, los, los hoteles en este caso. Ajá, Virginia. And also class, uh, what else? Mm, punctuation. The full stop, the comma, question mark, don't forget that. That is why it is important to practice when typing. And also your names, don't forget to write your names with capital letter. And one more detail, all the sentences begin with capital letter. Todas las oraciones inician con mayúscula. Yes? Yes. Okay, class. Yes. Thank you for joining. I hope today is going to be better. Mañana será bonito. Okay. So have a good night. Sleep well. And Flor, you stay with me. vacaciones, okay? compañeros. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. Ah, no, si falta Thank mañana. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 Take Nos care. Queremos ir. This is don't forget. I only okay. Flor. Good. 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 Bye. 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 Listening to adios, the teacher. Adios, no voy a hacer. Okay. <laughs> bye bye, Miguel. Have a good night. Bye bye, teacher. Bye, Miguel Angel. Bye, Rafael. Bye bye, Julio Cesar. Have a good night, Rafa. See you tomorrow. Bye bye, Julio. Thank you for being here. Take care. Bye bye, Miguel. Bye bye, Rafael. Have a good night, Rafa. Rafa, bye bye. Okay, Miss <laughs> Lord. We are going to get started, uh, but we're, you're going to communicate via chat, okay? And here we go. Bye, Rafa. Rafa cannot leave the room. Rafa, hoy Rafa no puede abandonar el salón. Es que quiere salir, pero no. Okay, have a good night. Bye, bye. Okay, Flor, here we go. Iniciamos, Flor, porque Rafa no, no, no puede conectarse. Siempre le pasa igual. Okay, veamos. I'm going to uh, make an emphasis on this, okay? And it is about the structure of the sentences. I'm going to arrive on Friday for things. Fíjese bien que how to use be going to, pero con significado de futuro. ¿Por qué? Porque van, a, van expresadas en relación a algo que ya se ha programado, pero no para el momento, sino para un futuro. Es decir, 
cuando utilizamos la estructura going to es porque ya damos por sentado que es en una agenda, ¿sí? Porque ya hay programación y hay fecha. En este caso, como es eh, viaje de negocios de una empresa, ya se tienen que haber hecho reservaciones. I'm going to arrive on Friday for things. And maybe you have the ticket already bought. I'm going to stay until Monday porque el vuelo o el evento al que usted va a asistir finalizará ese día, ¿sí? And then we have the negative sentences. Para convertir estas oraciones en negativas, lo único que hacemos es se mantiene la oración tal cual como va en forma afirmativa. Lo único que va not entre el verbo to be y going to. Ejemplo, Miss Puentes is not going to fly to Cuba on the 14th. Mr. Gómez is not going to arrive on Thursday the 13th. ¿Sí? ¿Estamos claros hasta aquí, Flor? Yes. Ok, very well. Y acá tenemos las yes, son aquellas preguntas en las cuales tenemos la posibilidad de contestar de forma afirmativa o de forma negativa, a diferencia de las information questions o WH questions. ¿Por qué? WH, entonces lo que estamos pidiendo es información, información específica. Por lo tanto, no podemos contestar ni en forma afirmativa ni en forma negativa. En ese entender, tenemos acá. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Are you going to make the reservation for a single or a double room? Estas son to stay in a smoking or in a non-smoking room. Okay, and here the information questions. What do we have for information questions? How long are you going to stay? ¿Cuánto tiempo se va a quedar? When are you going to arrive? ¿Cuándo va a llegar? Y veamos gramatical. To ask yes no questions about the schedule activities. Cuando formulamos preguntas, ¿verdad? Afirmativas o negativas acerca de actividades que ya se han programado, vamos a iniciar con esta estructura. The verb to be, John Mark. Veamos si se cumple este, esta regla gramatical. Ok, analicemos la primera oración interrogativa. The verb be, are. Yes, are is the verb be in this case. The subject of the sentence is you. Oh, vamos bien. Uh, going to es la estructura. Going to. And the verb. El verbo es stay, quedarse o permanecer, ¿sí? And the complement and at the end, the question mark. Let's remember that in English we only uh, use the question mark as in Spanish, ¿ok? ¿Estamos claras hasta ahí, Flor? Sí, muy bien. Uh, si tiene preguntas, me las escribe en el chat. Now we have information questions. Veamos si se cumple la regla. For information questions, just place the WH word phrase para construir oraciones interrogativas solicitando información. Únicamente tenemos que escribir al principio la frase o la palabra que inicia con WH. Pregunta en continuo la like you would do for a yes no question. Y la estructura se mantiene tal cual como lo vimos en la estructura anterior. En este caso, how long is the WH phrase? The verb to be is are. And the subject is you. Going to, the main structure we're studying. Going to es la estructura principal que estamos estudiando. El verbo es stay y el question mark at the end, ¿sí? Ahora, en la segunda pregunta, cuando The verb to be is are. The subject of the sentence is you, correct? The structure we are studying is going to. El verbo es arrive. Y al final, el question mark. Is that okay? ¿Sí? Si hay alguna duda, me pregunta, por favor. Ahí tenemos el chat. Y acá lo tenemos ya en contexto. Mire, when, WH question word, are is the verb to be. You is the subject. Going to, the structure. Arrive is the verb. And the question mark at the end. ¿Ok? Aquí lo estamos viendo ya en contexto. And here we have another question. How long is the WH question uh, phrase? Are is the verb to be. You is the subject of the sentence. Structure, el verbo, stay. Then the complement and the question mark at the end. ¿Ok? Ya lo vimos acá en contexto. Entonces, veamos acá. El vocabulario. ¿Ok? I don't know if you have a problem with the vocabulary regarding to a hotel. Yes or no? No, no problem. No hay problema con el vocabulario. No? Ok, perfect. And here, aha. Uh -huh. This is what I was telling you at the beginning. I don't know if you were at the beginning of the class, Rose, connected. No, no sé si estaba desde el inicio o no tenía problema con la conexión en el momento en que expliqué esto. Que hicimos al inicio de la clase, les hablaba de esta estructura. Miren, oración simple afirmativa. Rosa is the subject, correct? Is 
the verb to be. Going to the structure. Stay is the verb. The complement of the sentence for three days and at the end the full stop. Y al final, escribimos, nunca nos olvidamos del punto final. Again, in number three, Rosa is the subject. Is going to the structure. Stay is the verb. In a smoking room is the complement. In number four, going to the structure. Rent, the verb, and a car at the airport, the complement. Y siempre, siempre, si se fija, punto final. ¿De acuerdo? Y acá lo teníamos también en contexto, pero acá ya con are you going to, el verbo to be. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Yes. A esta frase, shuttle service, ahora la vimos, pero okay, de otra forma. Porque shuttle service es lo que ahora estuvimos practicando como, um, what is it? What is it? Mm, how can I help you? Reservation, please. Uh, Friday, going to going to stay with us until Monday. Your reservation. Okay, it, it is not here, but your partners did it. So, un grupo lo agregó. Are you going to uh, Are you going to need transportation from the airport to the hotel? Transporte. De acuerdo. Sí. Okay. Very well. Miss, I know you are working very hard. Okay. Sí, ha estado malo el Zoom. Yo creo que es problema de Zoom porque si no, no me podrían escuchar ustedes, ¿verdad? Y no se estaría grabando. Entonces, sí, usted tuvo problemas bastante de conexión y por aquí hubo alguien más que acá en privado me comentaba que estaba teniendo problemas con la, con la aplicación, pero logramos una vacación y también ya vamos a terminar, ¿ok? Miss, thank you so very much for giving me the time, ¿ok? I appreciate. Sí, estuve desde el inicio, pero con problemitas de Zoom, ¿verdad? Ok, Miss uh, Flor, have a good night, sleep well, and see you tomorrow, ¿ok? Bye bye, Flor. Take care. Bye. Have a good night. Okay, my pleasure. Bye.